In today's video, guys, I drop a 121 kill streak in three nukes in a life using my updated build with the Holger 556 here in Modern Warfare 3 Season 1. This build is super nice, really good mobility, no recoil, and it packs heat at those longer ranges you guys will love. So if you guys are new here, enjoy today's video, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel with noties on, and let's get into it. So now it's time to show you my updated build for the Holger 556 here in Season 1. This build is super nice. You can take your gunfights to any range, be very accurate, and also be aggressive. And for my first attachment, guys, I do think this class setup needs an optic so we are going to the optics here and what I'm actually using in today's gameplays is going to be the slim mine pro now there is a lot of good choices like I've said in my recent videos there's a lot of good choices from modern warfare 3 to modern warfare 2 with the slate reflector being the go-to optic that I like to use I wanted to switch it up a little bit and see how the best optic worked from modern warfare 2 which is the slim mine pro we threw it on it still works really good I do like it a lot so I went ahead tried something a little different it was fun to use so the slim mine pro is going on for my first attachment here now for our next attachment we are going to the stock and we're going to be adding on the rb adult assault stock now we're getting some recoil control and gun kit control for our build now now if i do bring up the stats we are getting a nine and a half percent increase in our gun kit control we have a almost a 13 percent increase in our horizontal recoil and we also have a 12 percent increase in our vertical recoil now so our weapon is not going to move at all we're going to be very accurate you know hitting our shots at any range which is good keeping the weapon smooth very important i think it is so we are going to be throwing this on for my second attachment here now since this weapon does have somewhat of a fast fire rate i am going to the magazine and we are going to be adding on the largest magazine which is a 40 round mag it doesn't hurt the weapon at all you really can't tell the difference of it taking away any mobility and handling away the only thing that you are going to notice is the reload quickness so if you want to add an attachment on or a perk that's going to help you you know reload faster you can run that but the 40 round mag just go ahead and throw this on it is going to help you not reload every time you get a kill or so and you're going to see in today's gameplays it does help Help me out a lot it saves my life a lot you know i don't have to reload all the time i'm not having to slow down i'm still on pace getting my high kill games and the 40 round mag never hurts my gun so we are going to be adding this on as well now we are going to jump over here to the underbarrel and what we're going to be adding on next is going to be the FTAC MSP 98 handstop grip. We're getting some aim walking movement speed, we're getting movement speed, we're getting some more gun kit control and vertical recoil control which is really good. Just making this assault rifle more mobile if you want to. You can move fast around the map. You're getting your movement speed up a little bit which is always good. We're moving faster while aimed down sights if it's strafing or just pre-aiming moving in general. We are moving a little bit faster which is always good and we're also getting a lot more gun kit control to this weapon and vertical recoil control so our weapon is more smooth more accurate very steady which is really good and then for my final attachment which is a new attachment i tried out i've been seeing a couple other youtubers trying it out and it honestly does work a lot and that is gonna be the x10 ported 290 which i do think actually gives you the most gun kick control horizontal recoil control and vertical recoil control all at once and as you guys see here a 27 percent increase in our vertical recoil control a 26.3 percent increase in our gun kick control and we're also getting a 10% increase in our horizontal, which is an insane amount, and it's not really hurting the weapon as much. But here's my updated build for the Holger 556 here in Season 1. This build is really nice, and as you guys see here in the graph, we worked on a little bit of range. We have a lot of recoil control going into this and a little bit of mobility as well. So we have full control of our build. We're moving a little bit faster, helping us be more aggressive, and we can take our gunfights to any range, which you guys will see in today's gameplay. Here is the rest of my loadout that I'll be using in today's gameplay. As we do have the Engineer Vest on. We're basically just getting our field upgrades really quick that's the main thing i'm using this for i do have the portable radar on so i'm just instantly getting them back every like two or three kills i'm just constantly throwing them better than a uav honestly if you are patrolling any spots we do have the renetti pistol going on i did do the conversion kit make it into the mp7 this build is pretty fun to use make sure to give it a try i think you guys will like it we do have the stun nades on just throw it on whatever you like honestly you do get two of them we do have the scavenger gloves going on though we have the stalker boots the eod pack in the tack mask which i do think is the best perk loadout if you are having four perks at once but try the build out guys and like i said in the intro we have a 121 kill streak and we also got a triple nuke in one life 90 kills without dying as well you guys will enjoy so if you guys are new here enjoy today's video hit that like button subscribe to the channel with noties on thank you guys for watching and i hope you enjoy no recoil see ya Little triple. We control Bravo. Enemy 
This gun is so easy to use. I still I still think this is the best assault rifle in the game. People might be think I'm bugging and stuff, but I I, I do think I do think this is the best assault rifle in the game. Easily. I should have threw on uh, some different streaks here. Alright, we got the swarm. That is amazing. Let's see how this goes. I mean, I... I, I think I think it is the easiest to use, but I I think the Holger, if you got the right build, I, I think it is, you know, it's just super easy. And I need ammo bad. There we go. Got 240 bullets out of that. I don't know how we did, but hey, we'll take it. My bad aim right there, dear lord. Yeah, I think I kind of, I might have made a mistake using the swarm on this map, but it is good. I am getting constant kills out of it. I just don't want to, I don't want to push yet because, I mean... I'll kill myself if I try pushing too hard up in there. I'm reloading. 201 kills on me. Let's go, bro. Alright, 22. There we go. Yo, Toxic, what's good? There we go. 26. Twenty-eight. You're not running out of the spawn on me, there, good sir. There we go, MGB. Now I can kind of push in here. I'm just gonna push and try flipping these spawns. Hey, hold on. This Chimera is actually insane, but I'm I'm just flipping through weapons right now. All right, 40 gun streak. Do I just try to see how high of a gun streak can go on? I mean, we're 60 and 0 right now. I'm reloading. We're losing I thought that dude was about to just lock on to me for a quick second. There we go. 67 kills without dying right now. Taking Charlie, they're taking Alpha. So where are they gonna be, where are they gonna be at then? Where are they going to... Oh, there's a sniper. There we go. Perfect. Oh, I'll always be crack toxic. I mean, always, man. I think they're spawning in front of me right here, honestly. No, not, not anymore. All right, we're 75 and 0 right now. Let's see if I can get to 100. I don't know what we got going on. I have no idea where my field upgrades go. I need it. Maybe my teammates can help me here. 
All right, we have two nukes in a life. We're on a six. We're on a sixty gun streak right now. Hold on. I kind of feel like I'm playing Battlefield right now. I don't. I don't know if you guys have played Battlefield before, which I'm. I mean, that's kind of a dumb question. I'm sure you guys have. But I kind of feel like, with how chaotic this is right now, I feel like I'm playing Battlefield. Seventy-one gun streak. We at ninety kills without dying right now. There we go. Perfect. All right, now we push. Oh, don't kill me, don't kill me. We have a hundred kills without dying. We did it. Oh my God. I mean, I didn't. Oh my god, I'm so glad 10v10 is here, man. Y'all have no idea. An 85 gun streak right now. Alright, we're on a 90 gun streak, but unfortunately, I'm not going to get the 100. I'm not going to get a 100 gun streak, but we do need to go ahead and call this nuke in. Let's go, man. Oh, my God. 113 kills without dying. 96. I almost got a 100 gun streak. I was almost on a 100 gun streak. Oh, my. 121 in one. Oh, my God. Got a 121 kill streak. No one does it like me. No one does it. No one does it. Let's go. Easy double kill to start this game off. Easy. I'm pushing this. They're spawning back here 100%. Maybe I lied. Maybe I didn't. All right, they're going to be in here. We're going to stun check it. Oh, my God. They're all going to... Hold on. They're all going to be spawning back in here, too. Yep, that was a... Cr that was a dumb push. What am I doing, bro? What am I doing? All right, 10 kills already. Not too bad. I don't know what homie's doing right there, but I, I can't can't get anything going right there with them. There we go. Nah, I'm not in Doom anymore. I left uh, a couple years ago. Good old flank. Bro thought he had the movement in him. I'm just going to flank. Yeah, I left in I left in Modern Warfare 19. Did we? I think we unlocked the. Uh, I gotta. Dang, I can't get out of there. I'm. This is a great lobby, but I what I need to happen is not happening right now. And we're just playing too much objective. I think I might have... We might push them. I, I, don't, I don't think I'll join an org unless, like, they give me some real good benefits of being in the team, but, uh... I don't know. If there's any orgs out there that want to hit me up, hit me up. All right, about to get the swarm now. Enemies inside the 
I don't know where these guys are going to spawn at. I'm pretty sure over here. I'll push this up here. Advance your AV. About to get this swarm. I think Hill's going to be... Yeah, he's doing good, too. Alright, I think I'm going to call this advance in. Alright, perfect. We got, we got the swarm. But I think I'm going to get this nuke first before I even ch attempt to call this in. My aim is terrible right now, dear lord. Let me... Thank God he is AFK. Alright, let's get this flank. Let's push them over there. There we go. A little 24 streak now. 55. Uh, I talked to Alpha a little bit. I mean, he doesn't even do Call of Duty anymore. And I talked to Adox a tiny bit. Everyone's just got, like, the old uh, spawn trapping group and everything. Everyone's just gotten old. All right, 27. 29. Who's going to be our 30th kill? I'm actually so scared right now. Okay, there we go. We got our MGB. Now I can call my swarm. See you later there, buddy. 63 kills. Come on. I need more than 63. I need more than 63. Okay, well, we need another streak. Yep. It, it's unfortunate, but I guess it's how life is. I don't know what homie's doing right here. Alright, we should still have a lot of time here, so I'm not gonna freak out. There we go. I thought that dude just on my team, uh, on the enemy team, just got a double kill out of that. I'm like, come on, bro. Come on, guys. Uh, he's right there. Are we doing that? Is that what we're doing here? The UAV ping just randomly and I'm still getting kills with my swarm that's one thing I do like about the swarm a lot is I mean even even if it's over it's still not over oh, I'm gonna push uh oh hurry up and reload gotta get back into that gunfight come on come on all right now they're holding p2 good Yeah, this build is super good. Alright, let's do this flank here. Come on, teammate. We have the same intentions. And Come on. Alright, 98 kills. We need to clutch this up. Yeah, the good old G36. Have you not uh have you not played this game yet, uh King? Make sure this guy's not in the corner. Okay. Wonder why I got killed. The dude's running the assassin vest. It's better than using ghost. 
Oh, you stopped at uh, 2000. Oh, okay. What did, how, how did I just die? Uh, okay, I mean, okay, that's, that's fine, I guess. They're gonna be over there. I mean, unfortunately, it did a lot of people. People just, I don't know. I, I feel like this, it should, I, I kind of like how this game is, and with all the Modern Warfare 2 attachments, if they did it the way, if they did it any different way, I don't think we would have gotten all of these attachments with the game. So, I am kind of glad that we did get uh, this game like how it is, like it's combined in the two. But also, uh, I, I wonder how this game would be if it was by itself. I don't know. Alright, we gotta call the nuke in now. We dropped 120 kills. I like that. I like that. And we should get it. I mean, we should get an extra 5 kills at least. At least. All right, nobody else. I mean, that's cool. I mean, was it 125 kills? We choked like three different separate nukes, unfortunately. Hey, 125 kills, still 125 kills. Let's go.